to start the day off with a nitro, seven dollar coffee. <laughs> and a sprinkle donut. guys welcome back to another vlog it is Friday today and me and Scott just went to the donut factory and I got this massive heavy donut but it is so pretty but it is really really big and it definitely feels like it's like 20 pounds and Scott got a big coffee as well but we are headed to where are we going babe Newport we're going to the Newport mansions we're gonna do a couple of tours of the mansions for the day let me put this donut down because I can't multitask. We're going to do a couple of tours and we're also going to go out to lunch. So we're having like a mini date today. And my parents have both toured the Newport Mansion. So that's what we're going to do as well. And yeah, we're going to go see the Breakers, which is like the biggest mansion. And then we'll see another one. I'm not sure which one we're gonna see, but. And then we're gonna go to Smokehouse Barbecue, which is a restaurant that has really good food, apparently. Michelle and Matt go to the Newport Mansions and they always eat there, so. That is our day. I'll show you guys. I think you can actually vlog in there, so I'm gonna try and vlog inside the mansion. Like a beast. Mmm. -hmm. <laughs> like a champ. mansions we just did a tour this is the outside of the biggest one which is the breakers what did you think of it babe i thought it was awesome it was really cool it was it was super crowded we were like, so we, crowded you had to go a specific way it's not like you walk through by yourself so mm -hmm. but it was really cool and you had headsets that gave you the history yeah it was really cool let me tell you those people it was they were rich yeah they were so pretty here. Let's go into the back one more time. Where are we going to eat, babe? Everyone. We were just kidding. <laughs> This one is called the Marble House. This one is really pretty on the inside. What'd you think of this one? It's nice, not as big as the other one, but. Still massive. Both of the mansions we went to today were owned by the Vander Vanderbilts. Mm -hmm. And it looks like they're setting up a wedding underneath there. <laughs> We bought a TV. We bought a 50 inch TV. We went to Walmart. It was, how much was it? 300 something? Oh, almost 400, but we really needed a new TV because ours was kind of tiny and football's coming up. So we got the big one. Go big or go home. Hey, why did they make this costume after you? <laughs> it's a sloth. 
It is cute. <laughs> oh, I like the gray one. <laughs> Glasses need to be on. We just bought a TV from Walmart. We were going to go to Target, but I feel like Walmart is a little bit cheaper. So we went to Walmart and now we're finally going home. Long day, kind of. Yeah, it was kind of a long day and we were like in the sun a lot. So we're hot and tired and we missed Teddy. So we're going to go home and we're going to set up the new TV and test it out tonight. So pretty excited. What are you doing? What? Are you getting groomed on Sunday? Finally? Yes, you are. You are. New TV is going right there. When we get into the... Be careful. <laughs> when we get into the barn, we want to kind of have our TV mounted, but I feel like this TV is going to be too big to mount. Because we went all out. I guess 50 inches in like It's obviously not the biggest, but... It's bigger than our 32 inch that we had. I'm excited. This was our other one that actually Brett and Megan gave us. Can't be watching football on that. No. They're like little ants running around. You can put the batteries in the remote. Did it come with batteries? This is an ugly remote. This is our remote. Ooh. Directions. <laughs> Who needs those? No, I think that's the stand that it just sits on. Obviously. <laughs> How come that one's so big though? I, all right, what's that? Oh, another, another part. Babe, you didn't know. What if it was an empty box? Probably would have felt that when I was covering in it. I'll just bend this corner and act like I'm doing something. Ooh, Teddy, a new TV. There it is. You excited? Don't put your fingers on it. There's a freaking thing on it. Yeah. It's the top and the bottom. I don't know. We probably could have gone bigger. <laughs> I said we should go bigger. It just I thought it was going to be the same size as the box almost, but I guess it's a decent upgrade. It's like double the size of that freaking thing. Yeah. My sweet boy. Hi guys, it is Sunday morning and I am going to go pick up Teddy from his grooming appointment. He's been there for the last three hours and I kind of had to drive like over a half hour to go to this grooming appointment because there was nothing available anywhere near me. So finally he's getting groomed and it's supposed to be super hot this week. So I think it's gonna be really good for him because his hair was so long. This guy's looking at me like, what the hell are you doing? His hair was so long and he couldn't see and I just know it was really hot for him. So I'm excited to see his haircut and I'm kind of nervous too because it was a new person doing his haircut. But I'm going to pick him up. I'm actually going to um, Office Depot to print out a coupon first because I have a 30% off coupon. So why not take advantage of that? And it's really hot today too. I do have the day off. Me and Scott went to breakfast. And I'll show you a little clip of our food. But we tried out this new place. And it was like downtown. And it was so cute. And we'll definitely go back there. It was very affordable too. But I am going to print out that coupon now. I gotta roll down my windows. So I'll talk to you guys once I get Teddy. Are you the cutest? Hmm? You're nice and groomed and clean. And you look like a baby deer. Where are you going? Oh, that's so cute. So cute, Puffin. <laughs> yes. 
Okay, you guys, I decided that I wanted to clean this up because it's really messy and this looks like this every single time I do my makeup. I'm just messy, I think. So I'm just going to organize this and go through some things. So let me just put my eyelash glue over there. This is the cream that I've been using for my face for my eczema, Vanna Cream. Someone re recommended it and I got it off of Amazon and it's really been helping. So this is what I've been using on my face. The handle did break when I bought it though. Um, my spray I'm gonna put away and here I have to clean my brushes today I keep on saying that I'm going to and then I don't so I have to do that it's just a lot going on here so I have all my concealers and my foundations in kind of the same drawer so I'm just gonna put those in here so concealers and then foundations in here. This is the concealer that I've been testing out over the last couple of months from First Aid Beauty. It's the Hello Fab Bendy Avocado Concealer and I really like it. So that one has been my go-to over the last couple of months. This powder from Bare Minerals I've had for such a long time. I wanna say I've had this powder for two years. It's probably expired. Let me see the little thing, does it say? I don't know. It's probably expired. I probably should throw it out, but I've been using it. Um, let's put the tweezers away. This is just a disaster. Let me put all the trash up here. Is anyone else this messy, or is it literally just me? I don't know what it is, but I just make such a mess. And there's, like, powder always everywhere. Okay, I'm going to try and quickly organize this and clean, and I will show you guys the after. I also have the worst look in the world, and I just spilled this whole Cora oil all on my pants. And I'm pretty sure this is not going to come out, because oil doesn't come out. So, this is just my These life. are the wipes that I like to use. These are the Clorox Sentiva. This is Pacific Breeze and Coconut, and I got the jumbo size of this. So, I just wiped everything down up top. It looks a lot better. And then inside, I briefly organized. I didn't do anything crazy, like a deep clean, but it looks a lot better than it was. So, yeah, this is the after. Morning. It is Monday morning, and I just made my chai tea from my Keurig. My Keurig's been acting up over the last couple of days, but it did work today. So I just made that, and then I also cleaned my makeup brushes last night because it really needed it. And Puffin, Puffin, look at Mummy. Puffin got groomed, he's so cute, and he's so much happier now. You got your watermelon? That's so cute, can I have it? Sit, are you sitting? Oh, sorry, here you go. But he feels a lot better, and he's so cute and cuddly and squirmy, he's like a whole new personality. I think I'm gonna end this vlog now though, because I have to work at 11, so I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you all next week, bye.